A city imbued with the spirit of excitement and a stadium enveloped by anticipation. This has all the ingredients necessary for a tasty football recipe. And both sets of players are ready to throw everything into winning the game for their fans. A mouth-watering prospect awaits. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live from London here on EA TV. An atmosphere of excitement and anticipation here in North London at the home of Arsenal. I'm Derek Ray, ready here in the commentary position, and alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and commentary midfielder Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Arsenal versus Everton. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. And this is the Arsenal starting eleven. Declan Rice starts alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And here's how Everton line up. Jordan Pickford stands between the posts. Seamus Coleman starts with Ashley Young as fullbacks. And leading the attack today is Dominic Calvert Lewin. Oh, surely! Oh, good reflexes from the keeper and the danger of Ozzie. Already closing him down here. Now they have possession in a good area of the pitch. And no problems at all for the keeper. And the pressure was sustained and coordinated. Tommy Yasu. And there's the feed into the box. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. A lot of excitement whenever Bukayo Saka is in the lineup. Stuart, what might we see from him in this game? Well, he's the most creative player on the field. He can run with the ball, he can get himself out of tight situations, he can see a pass, he's very creative with his play. I think he's going to be the outstanding player today. Cutting it back. In it goes! An early goal! No wonder they're celebrating! Well, just look at the setup here. It's such a clever back hill, and the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. Well, just look at his reaction. That could prove to be a massive goal for his team. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1 0. William Saliba. Saka really well played pass oh disappointing clearance what a lovely strike lethal piece of finishing drilled home with true conviction tremendous goal well just take another look at this he reads the flight perfectly, catches it so sweetly, and then bang. Not sure if the keeper was caught off guard. It's a long way out, but what a great strike. So back underway, following the equaliser. Amadou Onana. Idrissa Gay. Havertz. Well, very effective goalkeeping to touch it over. Corner kick given to Arsenal. Havertz! And a goal! Another one! Two in quick succession. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, here you can see it again. It's a superb cross, just asking for someone to go and meet it. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. Well, he has to come up with a game plan. His side are struggling now. 
So Everton restart the game, well aware that the pressure has been applied. How will they respond? And Kai Havertz, it's there for him. Well, what a stop it was. Well, I have to say, that's a magnificent save. That's a top-class piece of goalkeeping. And taken short. A deep delivery. And there it is! Two goals in a matter of minutes. Incredible stuff. Well, here's the replay. And they work it well just to change the angle on the cross. And it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. Well, he knows his team haven't been good enough in this game, but how does he change it? So on with the action, and 3-1 the scoreline at the moment. James Garner. Well, he's given it away. Effective looking pass. And Kai Havertz. Everton unable to hang on to the ball. And going for goal. Superb block. And there's the delivery. Smuggled away. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. And the referee allowing advantage to accrue to them. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Did well to win the ball back. Arsenal could be onto something. Havertz. And cleared away. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Oh, surely. Oh, wonder goal! Right out of the top drawer. Who could do better than that? Well, what a piece of skill this is. It had everything. Agility, technique and power. It's a great goal. Well, you've got to say, an incredible first-half performance. That scoreline tells you all you need to know. James Tarkovsky. Well, that is how to play advantage. Well, the fact of the matter is sometimes there is no advantage, and that was the view of the referee. Ducouré. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. What can he do with it now? Ducouré. Determined defending. Good through ball. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. McNeil might be able to set up the chance. Oh, fine stop. And the defender got the last touch. That'll be a corner. Delivering it.
William Saliba. Arsenal being afforded too much room. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Partey. Ben White. William Saliba. It's with Gabriel. Trossard. Well, it could be on for him here. And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. A glut of goals, 5-1 it is. Well, three minutes of stoppage time added on here. McNeil. Keeping possession of the ball with authority. And the referee blows for a foul. Delivered into the box. For the last line of defense. And there it is, the referee's whistle. The first half has come to an end here in North London. Well, Martin Odegaard is so very talented, and he's displaying all his talents out there on the pitch. Well, he has that assist to his name, but it's been his control of that midfield area that's made him the outstanding player today. Every time he gets on the ball, he seems to find the right pass. He's been excellent. And back underway. No sugarcoating it. There was a big gulf between the sides in the first half. Will we see a response from Everton in the second? Kai Havertz. Oh, nah, nah. Really getting stuck in. Not messing around with that clearance. Oh, nice ball over the top. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. And a long way out. Oh, tremendous work from the keeper to avert the danger. And Everton regaining possession. Now can they counter clinically? Calvert-Lewin. Oh, great attacking play. Cuts it back. He's blocked it! And he's in. Is it going to be? Oh, good save. And a substitution in the offing. They take it short. Rice. And making sure nothing untoward happened following the cross. Arsenal recovering possession well. And the shot was always rising. Goal kick. <laughs> Martin Erdegaard. Bukayo Saka. Now counter-attacking possibilities.
Really good challenge. And it will be an Arsenal free kick. Beautiful pass. And they could really get at the opposition. And putting pay to the danger. And quite simply, wide of the target. Coleman. It's with Ducure. On the ball, Coleman. Take it away. Declan Rice. Now in possession, Kosar. Oh, good vision. Coleman. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And nicely over the top. Martin Odegaard. Vital intervention. Declan Rice. Everton doing well to regain possession. And into the last 20 minutes. Well, that one has promise. Well, he had a decent reading of that ball in. Trossard. Making sure nothing came of it. McNeil. Looking for the angle. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Delightful pass. Havertz. Well cleared away. And the verdict of the officials is offside. Well, he just gets caught ball watching here. Needs to be more alive. Work harder to keep onside and be ready for the chance. Tarkovsky Amadou Onana here's Tarkovsky Onana James Garner and a clear foul but the referee letting the play flow McNeil and now Ducure This looks more than decent. It has to be! And fine goalkeeping. <laughs> Trying to pick out a teammate. Not the result from the set piece they were looking for. Useful cross, and you need your defender to take charge. Calvert Lewin, McNeil, and now Ducure using his strength to shield the ball, and he read it well. Five minutes to go. James Garner. Foul there. Free kick awarded. And the substitution will occur now. Substitution for Arsenal. Coming off the pitch, number five, Thomas Partey. To be replaced by 
Number 20, Jorginho. Well, nothing comes of it. Very quick thinking there. And three minutes of stoppage time to be added on. And that'll be offside. Throw in here for Arsenal. Martin Odegaard and Havertz. Happy to shoot. And a goal to seal the hat trick. A masterclass at finishing. Just can't stop him today. Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. Well, he knows his team haven't been good enough in this game, but how does he change it? Goal for Arsenal, number 29, Kai Havertz. Arnaud out then, Yuma. So there it is, the final whistle and a satisfying outcome for Arsenal and their many fans around the world. What did you think of their performance as a whole? Well, Derek, they were the better team all over the pitch. We saw good individual performances. We saw an attack which was always threatening and they played really well. What a performance that was today.